Yo, what is up everyone and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. 15 minutes, I'm going to try to end the video before that. This is my third recording. The first one I messed up, the second one I messed up because I had the audio off sync because I do live streaming, I do streams from Destiny as well as recording. So this is it. Stop talking about other things. These are everything that I noticed for the chain battle over the course of chain battle. I hit the 100 million mark. I'm in the top 1%. Yes, you can hit it too. Your box doesn't need to be amazing, but it needs to be the best you can make it because that's how you're going to get those friends out there that are going to want to help you and keep you on their friends list. Right. So I may burp in a moment and I apologize. Ooh, excuse me. All right. I just drank a lot of water. My throat was dry because I third recording, man. I've, I've been talking for like 60 minutes. Here we go. Number one, go through your battle log. Now, oh, ugh, the wrong button. I do not want to restart this. We're hitting, this is the one minute mark for the recording. Go through your battle log. Well, what is your battle log going to do? I can't use my units to, I can't use my units um, to, I can't use my own units in chain battle to hit high scores. No, you cannot. But you can see what other people are hitting with your units and whether or not you think people are going to keep you around on their friends list now if you go through um if you go through here and not only that you're going to get these thumbs up right you get some you know easy uh, chain battle points but you can look at the details someone hit a high score to oh let me give that thumb up someone hit a high score with my team earlier right before i started the first recording and i was like oh a high score they hit 71 million the highest i've seen someone hit with my score is 91 million i believe it was that's good to know because someone Say you go to the Reddit or you're on Twitter or you're in Discord or you come across another Dokkan Battle player and they're like, hey, I'm, I'm trying to hit a high score. I got a really good box, but everyone else, you know, their boxes kind of aren't that great and I'm looking for new friends. You can say, let's and let's say it's like midway through the chain battle event. You can say, hey, someone, my box isn't great, but someone was able to hit a 91 million score with my box. Would you like to be friends? Maybe their box is just slightly better than yours, but what you're about to offer them is like, 20 more million points than what they would have gotten with what's already on their friends list. So it's like he's winning because they're going to get that 20 million points by using your team. You just show him a screenshot of how the other person did it. We're going to win because you're getting a dude with a really good box. So yes, it's good to go ahead and take a look at what other people are hitting with your, with your, with your teams and, you know, always trying to adjust your team now. Um, step number two, connector cooldowns. And this is tip number two and three. I said step, I meant tip. Tip number two and three, connector and supporter cooldowns. Now, if you go to this little question mark, it'll tell you how to play. Click how to play. Supporter and connector cooldowns. I'm going to read the connector one because it says the same thing for supporters. If a character was selected as a connector, you may only reselect the character after 1600 PST or by restoring battle energy with a dragon stone. That's the same for supporters. Now, Someone has said, oh, if you close the app and open it back up, it'll shuffle the supporters list. No, I do not believe that's true. I did it like 10, 20 times. The first time I did it, it worked. But I think I did it as my stamina restored, which is one way your supporters will shuffle the box, right? But I did it like 10 times after that. It didn't do it again. It was set and sewn. It was the same setup of characters in a box that I knew had... It was like a bunch of go tanks. I'm like, I know there's a bunch of ultimate Gohans in here. Where are they at? And I kept looking. I would take screenshots and I'd double check. No, no, no. So, um, <clears throat> so I know I went a little bit on how to shuffle your supporters, but this is connector and supporter cooldown. So let me just throw that out there real quick. Connector and supporter cooldowns will refresh at 1600 PST. So if you use a connector, and we'll go show you the connectors. If you use connectors and supporters, right? So we'll jump into the start. They will refresh at 1600 Pacific. That's 4 p.m. Pacific, 5 p.m. Mountain, 6 p.m. Central, 7 p.m. Eastern U.S. time, right? That's the time zone. That's the time it would take, right? So here's your supporter. If you use, if you use, Mar I'm going to use Marshall and his, this is the dream team. I'm going to use him. I'm going to pick my connector. Oh, here's my, uh, here's my rainbow Gohan, right? I'm going to pick, uh, oh, we're going to come over here and pick Berserk. And here's my, uh, rainbow boo oh here we go <laughs> close enough um and i'm gonna use them and i hit attack i won't see these guys for another day i won't see this friend for another day so let's let's unless i use a dragon stone or i wait till tomorrow right 
So, and we'll cover dragon stones here in a moment. Five minute mark, pretty good. Um, let's say, uh, I I hate hitting that back button. Let's say, what was that, Marshall? Let's say Marshall. Let's say, man, here's oh man, Raijin, here's Raijin. Well, let's let's say let's say uh, here we go. Let's say Kiki. Let's say Kiki. I'm like, man, Kiki, what's up with these? What's up with that Gohan and that Gotenks? Where's your Where's the rest of your ultimate Gohans? Where's your uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks? I know what's in his team because I've seen it before. And then it's like, oh, wait, I've also seen these go. I had never seen these Gohans here. So if he has these Gohans, the physical Gohan, the tech Rainbow Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, and another ultimate Gohan, um, the EZA Int ultimate Gohan, I know he has those. I want it to shuffle. How do I get it to shuffle, right? We're going to dive into that in a, right here. We're going to transition into it. How do I get it to shuffle? If you use this team, you won't see that until you use a Dragonstone. But if you spend your stamina, right? Let's say you spend four stamina bars on just unlucky units, unlucky teams. And you want to save this last stamina. I usually just save one. I don't know why. No reason other than to always be able to go into start. And maybe I want to take that chance. Maybe I don't, right? Or I want to use it and then use a Dragonstone. Um, if you wait for it to restore... In three hours, like the three hour mark, which starts from the time you use your first stamina bar. Right? The three hour mark starts. And it, it, you know, it just counts. That's when it'll shuffle your friends. That's when it will shuffle your friends. That's what I've noticed. There's no other way to shuffle your friends. There's no other way for me to get Kiki, all of those great units, unless I use a Dragonstone or I wait the three hours, right? So, you know, that's how you shuffle your supporters. Don't use them. Use other people. Go down and look at a guest. Um, and see, boom, Rico. Wow, Rico. Maybe, may, wow, Rico. I mean, Rice. Oh, my. You know, and this is, you know, I'm actually going to, so this is what I would do. All right, there's a guest. Maybe he has a, a better choice, but the LR, <laughs> the LR kids. Okay. Um, you know, the pr prime example, maybe he's, he's just missing that one unit. So let's go down. Let's see. Let's find another guest, right, real quick. And, uh. I'm going to let this play through as I do this, man. I, I apologize. There's my with a bunch of booze. Come on. Whatever, Joe. We're going to use Joe and whatever, Joe. Whatever. I don't, I don't care. I want a friend request that rice, dude. Um, But yeah, it's like, wow, you found a guest that has a really good unit. And maybe he has a better unit than that LR, Gotenks, and Trunks. I'm going to run this through. I'm going to send a friend request. Another reason to look at your battle log and keep your supporters good because people are going to be looking for you and guests. They're going to be like, wow, this guest actually helped me hit really high numbers. Oh, I misclicked. Um, let me send them the friend request. Now, I would try to give this a good chance to run against this team because if I hit a really low score with this guy, right, he may not take the friend. He may look back and be like, well, he didn't hit a very high score with me. I don't want to be his friend. He doesn't know what he's doing. Like, he may not take this, right? So um, I'm crossing my fingers and hoping I, you know, for the sake of the video, for you guys, I didn't take more time finding a good boo or picking a good boo, right? I, and I didn't send the friend request! I hate you, YouTube. Anyway, so that's what you would do. You would send the friend request and not be an idiot like me. That's all right. That means I'm going to use a stamina restore. Um. Uh, now, what this is going to do is this is going to shuffle. I may not see Rice again, so I'm going to do this in my free time. So that's how you shuffle your supporters. That's how you look out for, you know, friends that are not on your friends list. Yes, we're at nine minutes. Um, How to max maximize your Dragonstone usage. So I just use one Dragonstone to shuffle my, to restore all my connectors, right? Because my connector, my fat boo was gone, right? And I used it to shuffle all of my friends' boxes. Not the friends. All my friends could show up. At any point, I could just update and look for them forever. But it's going to show the different units in their box, right? So that's how you would maximize your Dragonstone usage. Now, Truth said in his video, you're going to get your best runs with Dragonstones. That is true, and that is not true. You're, you're going to see... You could see your best runs quicker with Dragonstones because you're, you're instantly refreshing that stuff on a, you know, five times a day. If you just wait those three hours... Everything but your connectors changes. So don't use the friends that you know have really good units that you just got to get lucky with. Wait for it to refresh three hours or six hours or nine hours, right? And then uh, 
And then, you know, always check back three hours every time a stamina bar, every time a, sta a stamina bar must restore. You can, I don't think you can just wait three hours with full stamina bar. I don't think that's how it works. Can't confirm. Haven't tried it yet. So, you know, think about that. Um, you're just going to see the Dragonstones are just going to make the process faster. We're free to play. It would be slower, but I think you can hit the same results because I've only spent like 20 Dragonstones. Today, that was my first Dragonstone I spent. That was my first dragon stone I spent, and I hit the 100 million mark today. So I got it. I just got really lucky. But I knew, ev I knew I had everyone on my list that I needed. I just needed to get that. I just needed to be lucky. So you can, you know, don't use your connectors when you don't need to use your connectors, right? Now here's all my, here's my Gohan, and here's my, uh, here's my uh, SCR Majin Buu. Don't use them on teams you know are not going to hit. 100 million do not use them on teams you know are not going to hit 100 million right and let's take a good let's take a look real quick how do i know what teams are going to hit high scores don't look at the battle log for that you're going to want to look at what everyone else is hitting so i you can go to the supporter box right supporters for lending and you can hit that info hit the battle results and look at other people what are they doing one two three four five fat majin boos a bunch of rainbow ultimate gohans a random, a random boo, uh, a rainbow go tanks, rainbow, rainbow, right? Uh, you, you know, LR Hercule, not rainbowed, rainbowed, one, two, three, four Majin, fat Majin boos, and then two other boos, rainbows at the top, a go tanks is in there, a non rainbowed go hunt, like just look and see what they're hitting it with. And those are the, and what has it, what's in common with this chain battle is fat Majin boos are the way to go. It's the, it's the main connector on global. And the more fat Majin Buu's that you can group up with on a support team, the better. I'm sorry, my nose is itchy. The better score you're going to hit easier. You don't. You're not going to need to hit like. Uh, you're not going to hit. Need to select your three units in. You know, uh, half a second, or they all have to be rainbow, right? But the more fat Buu's you have, the less rainbows you need to have, because I barely broke a hundred million, but I broke it, right? I didn't have five Majin Buu's, right? But I broke it. They weren't all rainbow. <laughs> but I broke it. And we'll show my team off in a minute. Uh, in a moment. So I covered the tips. Uh, um, go through your battle logs. Connector and supporter cooldowns. How to maximize your dragon stone usage. Um, get crappy units. Get crappy units. For the love of God. Get those crappy units. Because again, if you go through that battle log. I bet you've seen this tech, this tech Majin Buu somewhere. Uh, he's free to play. Not only that. But he was able to uh, super attack. Increase my STR to rainbow. And my physical... Um, as high as he could go to uh, two dupes, right? And you can get him from the Dokkan event, um, from the Majin Buu Evil Reincarnation, right? Pure Destruction and Carnage, boom. Info, stage one. Boom. The drop rate's not horrible. I would usually get, for every five runs I did, I got like five of these. Not every single time. Sometimes they drop twice in one run. Sometimes they drop none. But the drop rate's not horrible. It's 10 stamina. It, it was worth it for me to go... Grind out the super attack for my Majin Buu's, get them, use them, put them in my boxes. Because again, other people are looking at your boxes. Other people are looking at what you have to offer. And some of those whales out there that no one knows about is going to be like, hey, this guest has a pretty good box. Let me link up with them because it's doing better than what I currently have, right? And then they send that friend request out that I forgot to send. And now you just you 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 log into Chain Battle one day and it's like, wow, look at this dude. It's all rainbows boom top one percent you may make it because you put some effort into your box and it's just a common courtesy maybe not everyone's going to be because you don't need a you don't need your whole friends list of whales you just need like i would say like four or five people that have a lot of rainbow units and you're set i'm not telling you to go remove everyone from your friends list that's not a whale that doesn't have rainbows or doesn't even know what they're doing like i have people with goku black teams on here and stuff like i'm like no, just let them be but the people you're looking for. I did make room for people that knew what they were doing, had good boxes, and, you know, I talked to Reddit or Discord or Twitter or anywhere. I made room for them, and I also try to improve my box as best I can. So improve your box, get the crappy units that nobody wants to grind. You will have a better chance of hitting the higher scores, and people will be like, hey, I'll keep you around in future chain battles because you didn't do too bad this time. And I think that covers everything. Now let's go ahead. We're 14 minutes and 30. We're going to go ahead and show the, my score for the top 1%. Those are all the things I kind of noticed here. Hopefully the mic didn't cut out at all. I'm, I'm trying to look directly at the microphone, but the camera's over there. And um, we're going to look at the details. So I use, this is a three dupe Gotenks. This is a one dupe, right? 69% uh, strength Gohan. 
everything is rainbowed up here but the uh, tech super saiyan 3 go tanks right the categories type and link skills you know we have 33 that uh match up we have one and then we have 27 the 99 million run i did a 99 million run i had 38 two and 31 so i had a total of three four five ten i had ten more categories types and link skills shared between my top team and i still didn't break the hundred million now i did it a little bit slower than this i think i did it either like 0 0.8 0 0.8 seconds or it was 1.17 i don't remember it might be in the last video i recorded where i showed it off not sure um and I don't want to look go look back. I don't want to burn any more time on this recording. And then we had, you know, the SCR Majin Buu. Again, Favela. Shout out to Favela. You really carry me through here. I'm going to try my best to make sure you hit whatever you want to hit in the future. So please don't remove it from your friends list. And a, a lot of other people. Raijin, uh, our baited waifu. Uh, all of those. Every Everyone. Everyone that, you know, linked up with Kenkuken or Kenku. I got, I'm going to get you. I got you. Best I can, right? I'm trying. But yeah, we have one, two, three, four Machin Boos. And then, but everything's rainbowed but two, right? My guy's rainbowed, 31, two, and 32. Um, oh, my game froze? Okay. I believe they even have the STR one. I think they have five Machin Boos. I think they have the STR one, the UR version. So I could have gotten an even better run. But I seen this and I'm like four here and rainbows up there. And I was able to use the free-to-play Gohan. I did it in my fastest time ever, 0.6. I use emulator exclusively, so it's mouse and keyboard. And I have 12 and 10 links where I think the other one that I did at 99 million had, I think it was 12 and 12. Once again, I had more here, but I don't really, I don't know what really pushed me over the 100 million. Was it the fact that I had more Gohans? Was it that fourth? I, th I really think it's that fourth Fat Majin Buu and a little bit of me doing it fast enough, and I got lucky on selecting all rainbows at the end, which I did the last time too. So anyway, we're gonna wrap this video up at 17 minutes. I broke the promise of 15 minute mark, but thank you so much for watching. Super appreciate it. Let me know in the comment section below, please. Let me know if this helped you. Shorter video and then the 40 minute one. And yeah, subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it for token battle content, Destiny 2 content. Um, you know, thumb it up share it with others because these tips that i just came through with they're going to help in every chain battle this will not be the only chain battle video i do because i think people are going to need help in the future but this is you know this was one that really mattered the most because our connector was so limited to str majin Buu. so good luck if you see this video before chain battle goes away tonight good luck good luck good luck yeah i would blow five stones to shuffle all that now that you know what you're doing Blow those five stones tonight. If you're really, really close to 100 million, you know you got it in there somewhere and you just want to get those extra rewards or even the top 1%. It's like six, 96 million, 97 million is the cutoff right around there. And you're so close. I hope this video helps you reach it. I hope your five stones don't go to waste. Remember, we're going to get a bunch of free stones here real soon. But I would also save them because the banners are right around the corner. And five, summon, five stones for a single summon. You'll, someone's getting the new units. Anyway, I'm out of here. Thank you so much. And remember... Uh, thanks for watching. I don't know. Goodbye. <laughs>